Imagine a scenario where you're playing a video game and then suddenly the characters become sentient and can talk back to you. Last episode, it was a very funny and wholesome moment when people started asking like, who are you? And we're like, oh, don't worry about us. And he's like, what's a sundere? And it's like, that's funny. That's funny. And then later I, I started thinking to myself, wait, isn't this incredibly messed up? Like, I'd be, star I I'd be terrified. I'd be super worried if that was happening, but it's fine because it's anime logic. Let's begin today's reaction. Is this a place? Oh. Going to a girl's place during summer. Awesome. Hang out. We brought a gift too, right? Oh, hello. Mother? Yeah. Oh. Oh. That's a MILF. That's a MILF. Oh my god, that. She is dressed. Older sister. Never mind. I can't rely on like. I thought it was a mom. Older sister is great too. Wow. She's got the mature sense. Did you look at her outfit though? God damn. Where's she going? Relax. Focus on Kawaii. Yes, that's right. This is the main ship, right? Outside the game. What is she wearing? Oh, it's like a one piece dress kind of thing with the shoulders cut. Oh, okay, okay. Yes, we saw your big sister. <laughs> Relax. Focus on Kobayashi. Reverse harem. Oh. Even leaves. Oh. Oh. See, I was confused because Fine is like the main character of this game, but then there's a lot of highlight around Lise. But if we go the reverse harem route, now Lise is also an opportunity to get in the spotlight with Fine. Hmm. And it's a happy ending. Back at the cafeteria. What's a big ass thing? God damn, Fine. It's not very ladylike, but who cares? Enjoy that meal. <laughs> the way he says, <laughs> it's, it's totally a baseball commentator, like they said. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> <laughs> it's actual commentary, like sports analysis and commentary. Where, where is, she, where is he gonna sit? On Lisa's side or Fina's side? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Gotta fix the hair. Already a super blushing. Oh, I didn't notice you. Hello. <laughs> it's just, it'd be funny if she saw uh, Lisa like uh, like shaking her hand for drinking the cup, the tea. But if you go for the hair, she's gonna get super blushed. <gasps> oh. Oh. Blushed again. Oh. Oh. You gotta make such a commotion. <laughs> Whoa! I did it. Okay, we're back with the Sun Sun part, you know? Not much Dere right now. Yo, you just have to yell that in the cafeteria? But this is the this is the appeal of the sun today, right? She's trying to be a little bit thorny, but but come on, show us the charming side. It's because I care about you so much. Oh, killer line, right to the heart. Now, was it enough charm to melt the ice? <laughs> this sports commentary voice acting. <laughs> It's so good! <laughs> this is so dramatic. <laughs> Rainbow sparkles and everybody in the cafeteria just stopped to watch her. <laughs> oh my god. Chosen by the gods. Thank, thank you for letting everybody know what's going on, Teague. <laughs> They're crying! They're actually crying! <laughs> Standing ovation! <laughs> I guess it's a big deal in this crowd, but I'm just thinking in just like the day-to-day -day life of these guys. Like I'm Baldur right now, I'm trying to eat lunch coming out and everybody's like crying. Oh my god, it's been chosen by a goddess. This is so ridiculous. We have selected Baldur this time. Now everybody's gonna be like, oh my god, Baldur 2? Impossible. <laughs> Masaka. <laughs> Baldur is like, bro, I just want to eat lunch. <laughs> what's, what's going on? Oh, okay. I love the fact that so you guys to like announce it and like confirm it to everybody else. Sure, I'm not sure what's happening, but yes, you've gotten the God's blessing. You powered up. Let's team up. Whoa. Uh -huh. Your Highness. What an epic lunch. This is, this is, this is a crazy lunch period right now. They're having a blast. This is going well, but it's still. Oh, the next day, the gig. I mean, uh, probably the next day she came over. We brought watermelons. Man, 
Summer is passing by real quick. Did we go over every day? But what about our romantic ship? If there is a romantic ship. Are we just friends playing a game that we just enjoy together? Or, you know. Endo, you gotta make it... You gotta make your intent clear. Oh. We can push Fine and Arto. Yeah, you dog. It means that maybe there's a part of him that likes Fine. Why would he get such a reaction? Unless he maybe truly cared about Lisa Rote so much that... How dare you talk to her like that? Okay. Target. What a word. A practice match. What? Arthur versus Fine in a practice match? Fighting? She's down. Huh? Oh, is this actual duel? What is this practice match? Are we practicing who's better at healing? Baldor and Fine versus Art? No, wait, 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 wait. Baldor and Art versus Fine. What is this match? We're drawing our weapon! Um... Can Fini fight? Zeke was pretty intent on... Hey, watch what she can do. What can she do? Uh... she like... Is she gonna tackle him? Just straight up bulldog... That's a punch. Hmm? Uppercut? Shoryuke out of nowhere, how? Is she gonna snap the sword? Watch. Dude, Baldur... He actually swung! <laughs> with full intent! What? Strong and agile. Um, we don't need offensive magic, but she's really strong. Why? I don't know. At level 99. Wait, we wait, what? Wait, we over leveled her on this account, I guess. You know, the best part was when Baldur actually drew his sword and like swung with intent to maybe kill. Sir Ball. It's Battle Door Ball. I get it, but when you call it Sir Ball. <laughs> yeah, you like danced on his sword after he missed and like punched him. <laughs> DPS healer. Huh? I. Uh, sure, why not? Okay, she can heal and be offense. It's not clear. Somebody was grinding her, I guess. Her arm got slashed off before, in the past, healed it, then fought the- Yo, Fine is a monster. This- she can take care of herself, she doesn't need any guy, man. This is insane. Who? Lise, are you hiding somewhere? <laughs> of course. <laughs> Try to be more discreet. It's not like I was looking or anything. Getting friendly with Fine. Uh, we were hosting a duel. Yeah, it's not like I was stalking you or anything. <laughs> Tell him. That. Okay, whatever. It's back. More information. So, ha immediately, huh? I mean, she just wants to hang out with him. But it's so funny when she makes these excuses, like she's just in the background corner, like, just, just staring. <laughs> That dress is too wide, like, you gotta be more discreet. Oh. In front of it. See, I mean, I guess this is all respect, but... With Zeke... I don't know. Oh! oh! How dare you touch me! <laughs> Filthy casual! You dare touch me without even being my fiancé. Hmm? Oh no, she's being mean again. Come on. I know you're not mean. She's just acting out right now. Her tune is popping off. She found it the lost and fun. Come on, she's poor. She got nothing better. Oh! Hey, that means maybe she'll get her something better. No, no, she's just being mean like before. You know how she made fun of us? Like, you stupid comrade. You don't even know how to use magic. And then. Fine, I'll teach you. Oh, it's okay. I got you. Watch, watch, watch. The sun has come out. Where's the dead, eh? You gonna... Okay, she's gonna give us a better one, right? Here it is. Here it is. See, she always gets us with this. It's so mean, and then it's like... I got something better for you. Don't worry. Oh my god. 
It's actually too small. It's that's even a lie. It's not a spare. She probably spent months crafting this for her. She's like, right. He understands. Zig understands. This is they've they've done this again. Like this is a little bit of a repeat of how she made fun of Fine for not being able to use magic or no matter and then she taught her like it's a repeat but it's still so good i yo they can continue with this every episode it's i'm gonna fall for it every time it's suited for healing and supportive it's almost as if it's specifically catered towards fine oh it's not a spare it is a spare no it's not a spare oh yeah it's just a spare it's not like i care about you or anything <gasps> oh, there she goes flushing. Her entire body flushes. Like, it's not just a blush. It just flares up entirely red. <laughs> she has to run away because she got so embarrassed. Mm. His love grows deeper. Look at the way she's running, lifting a dress like that. It's so cute. But now, what about Endo and Kobayashi though? I know I want something to grow in there too. The power of Tsundere, sorry. Tsundere Ice is too powerful. Snaps the wand, you filthy commoner. This wand is so disgusting. Here, I actually have a spare for you. I, def I definitely didn't spend all week trying to make it for you specifically. Oh, don't worry. It's just a spirit. I don't care. Runs away. It's so cute. It's so cute. I'm going to fall for it every time. I hope there's like a Tsundere moment like this every time. I I'm down. I'm down. But hey, if you stick around the song and if you enjoy my reaction, please subscribe and check out the other videos and playlists on my channel for even more content. Until next time, take care.